start so you're ready? Yeah, it's thank you, Jordan. Um, wow, thank you. 4-1, probably flat with Man City. Would you consider us a fair assessment of today's performance from your team? Yeah. I'm on, I mean, it is... The goal when you go in such a game is uh, to make it as difficult as possible, the top teams, to let them struggle a little bit. And when everything works perfect, then you have a chance to take it. We have two, ta two games this season against them, but we had uh, taken a point, I think. Um, today we had, didn't have a perfect game. Huh? I must say that we have played much better than in the last home game against them, where we drawed. We had more problems, we had uh, them really on the back foot today. It was, you don't see Man City very often kicking balls long from the goal kick because they don't want to build up anymore. So that shows you how good we have been today. And as soon as you come in such a moment, you must take your chances you have better than we did today. And don't give them easy moments to score. And we did them twice. You gave them twice the chance for scoring easy, and this is not possible against this team. And that's the reason why we lost in the end. Until the 75 minutes where the third goal happened, we have seen a very equal game, I think, a very tight game. This is what you want to show. And until that moment, I think it was one of our best games against them. But in the end, uh, it was uh, not good enough. Is that lack of a clinical edge the most frustrating thing for you? Because as you say, City were, you know, their goalkeeper was booked for time wasting with 20 minutes to go, but they were trying to slow the game down because you were bringing it to them. Is that the fact you didn't take those chances more frustrating than anything else? Not only this, uh, but uh, even more, I think the fact that we, that we uh, make mistakes like Sally's penalty where he's running out of the box and there's no need to make the step here and clear penalty for me. And Mike Dean immediately gives it. This is normal huh? because when you give them such a chance, then you cannot be surprised that they take it. And uh, yeah, this is against such a team, not possible always to, to give a, a chance away like this. We had the equalizer chance, I think, after this. But uh, I must say that uh, also the intensity of, of the game dropped after 60 minutes. After my first two subs, where normally you should expect that the fresh players are coming on and, 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 and make, them, make it even better. It was not happening today because, because it's not so easy to come in such an intense game yeah, because it is such a high tempo there. And uh, especially when you come on, it needs a little bit of time to adapt. Uh, and this, is the, this was the issue, I think, in the, in the end. We haven't had the same intensity after the 60 minutes like we had before. And uh, I must say, before it was, as I said, one of our best games against them. And just finally, from you, you rested Tino for the for the Watford game. You said you you made pull out a big number twenty one squad. Very much how he does today. He's played ninety minutes today. Do you, you expect him to go with England tomorrow? Yes, him and uh, a few other players are going. I'm happy for them. So Tino will go. You Tino will go. Yeah. yeah. Thank you, Mark. Uh, Ralph. How much damage has this done to the mindset of the group? Because you've had such a fantastic season, you've been so positive in so many ways, but recently forms just tailed off. No, no, no not not the minimum damage, I think, because we can be proud today for what we have done. I must say, uh, I haven't seen so many teams playing against Man City like we did today, to be honest. And this is uh, very positive for me uh, and shows what we are able to to do and what we are able to give. And uh, I think everybody in the stadium today enjoyed the game. Uh, everybody saw a team here fighting for everything, and this is what we want to do. And and uh, it worked very good today, I must say. The game against the ball was, they tried everything, and it is super tough against them. And they, they never found the rhythm to, to, to play us around until, uh, I think, until the third goal. And then it is easy, because then you break your mentality. And then and this is what, what Pep knew, I think, was in the first half. They wanted to go for the second goal immediately. Uh, we made the equalise and the game was open again. And, and this is what, what you have to do against such a team. Never, never hide, uh, try to be brave and, and play football also in the right moments. And yeah, no, absolutely. Very, very proud of what we have done today. Absolutely. How would you take the, the qualities from today's performance into other matches? Because you all seem to raise your game against Manchester City. You all seem to play well. But yeah, no, but I think that also the intensity in the last games up front was not the same like today. And I must say, 
This had also something to do with the players they have played there up front today. They did a very good job, yeah? fantastic runs, and and uh, you see how difficult it is then. And uh, yeah, it's a pity that we don't get the reward for this work we have done today. And just finally, obviously international break now. What will you do over the course of the next week or two to try and change things around? You obviously lose some players, you'll have yeah. a small group to work with. Yeah, recover, <laughs> recharge the batteries. I think uh, we have another nine games to go or something like that. Eight, nine, nine, I think. Uh, enough work to do to end up as high as possible in the league. And uh, yeah, we need this break now. Guys get a little bit rest and then we come back hopefully with full batteries and then we go. Right, how, do you, how do you take that next step? Because it seems so often you're able to match the best teams well, I think we have shown this season also that we can play longer than only 60 minutes. We drawed against them twice in the league. I mean, I haven't seen a lot of teams doing this. So, but but uh, no, uh, there must be a different. Uh, sorry, <laughs> we speak about uh, a team that uh, is uh, three times champion in the last four years. So. <laughs> It's not it, it, who thinks we can we can match them and and and, uh, and to play them around. I think this is not not not, not the way we, we 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 have to expect this. But I think it's nice to see when you when you let them struggle a little bit eh? and how difficult it is then for them to find in the rhythm eh? and to do this that costs a lot of braveness and a lot of uh, hard runnings and and a lot of work against the ball. But when you do this. Also, this team can struggle, and also this team can can get some issues. And this is very, very. Yeah, this is what Pep always says that he it makes him better when when he sees that he plays against a team that gives him something to think think about. And I think we did today, definitely. Well, does the international break come at a good time? It comes always on a good time. <laughs> Absolutely, because it's an intense time between the international. The last one we had. I think in November, and then we had a break in, in, in January, but it's good It's good to have. Oh. Sorry? Sorry. Yeah. He is absolutely okay, yeah. He has a big game for Poland next week, and it seemed to me that he's not 100% with his mind uh, for us here to, today. It, I think I didn't want to take the risk that he, in some moments, maybe doesn't make the last step to, to hurt himself or something. And in, in this game, you need players, they, they do this. I haven't seen it again. I, I only know that it was a big one. And we played it fantastic before because Moy was, was especially what, what we tried to do, come with the first touch in behind the high line they had, they had very often. We did it in some moments very good. Uh, Armas chance in the first half. And we had a few good moments and yeah. I haven't seen how big this chance was, but I think it was a big one. Yeah? Okay, thanks so much, everyone. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Have a good break, eh? You too. Who has it?